everybody and welcome back to another video with the lecture soul if you're new to my channel i'm a psychic medium a spiritual life coach and just that spiritual bitch putting everybody on alongside a whole lot of other things but today in this video guys what we are going to be discussing is a concept that i've definitely spoken about this on my channel just to let y'all know it is yes about mental diet but it is going to be about why mental diet is so important okay how does it benefit you what does it do for you as a conscious manifester of your reality and as somebody who within my own reality is very big on mental diets and you know I keep my mental diet in check because I'm only allowing the best of the best to go through my mind I'm gonna tell y'all exactly what I do for myself how it works how it helps all that good stuff and especially if you are somebody who doesn't really keep up with your mental diet but you know that you should or you know that it would help benefit you I'm gonna tell you guys exactly how to get used to keeping up with your mental diet because this is also extremely important when it comes to manifesting what you want all right the reason that I say that is because while you are manifesting what you want obviously thinking in favor of your desires is a big like a big plus you know you got to do that of course you have to because that's what manifests what you want you know if you're assuming in favor of your desires then how would it not happen for you especially when you are claiming that these desires are manifested in your highest favor so all you're going to do here is to stay focused upon the fact that your mental diet is in check you are assuming in favor of everything that you want constantly or at least as much as possible. I do want to say that even with mental diets, you don't have to drive yourself crazy trying to keep up with your mental diet. I definitely do feel like for some people it is a work in progress in the way that not everybody feels totally secure or just on their shit when it comes to their mental diet or at least when they're starting out. And the reason for that is because some people in this life, you know, we've had very negative mindsets. No, we never have, okay? But y'all know what I'm saying. You know, maybe in the past, we we had a mindset that we persisted in for so freaking long we would assume the worst out of everything we would have the worst mental diet okay everything would be like oh bad luck for me this that I'm not gonna say anything else but it's all stuff that you know doesn't resonate with you but that confirms your shitty reality right here it's the complete and total opposite because we're not doing that all right we're not going to be entertaining anything that doesn't help us feel like our very best selves especially while we are manifesting what we want because if you are manifesting an SP money happiness beauty longer hair more vacations going on free vacations anything like that you got to be sure that your mental diet is actually working in favor of again these desires in the way that you're complementing it you're talking up to it you're remaining optimistic with it you're reminding yourself of how limitless you are so there's no reason for you to fail or fall behind because you literally can't and all of this energy right here is 110% something that will keep you down pat for real while you are manifesting what you want as somebody who again does have a very strong self concept well I, I'm sure that just came out of my mouth but yeah I guess you can say definitely self-concept because the mental diet helps that all right the reason I have such a high self-concept is because my mental diet is truly in check all right guys so with that being said we can get started with the video so that we can get to talking about keeping that mental diet in check why it's so freaking important to do so okay because when it comes to mental diets if we want the best of the best we need to be on our own sides and this is extremely important guys I'm never gonna sit here and let you just fall victim to your reality. I don't let anyone in my life <laughs> fall victim to their realities. I really don't, okay? I am that person who's doing everything that I physically, mentally, spiritually, and emotionally can to ensure that you are right on track, all right? Manifesting the very best case scenario for you in every single way. Because I want and need everyone around me and everyone who watches me and everyone who listens to me to understand that we all deserve to be up there, up in the sky, because that's exactly where we belong, of course course it is. We are way too powerful, way too special, way too strong for anything less. And because you are so powerful within your own reality of you understanding that you really are in that much control, you've got to choose to get up and to only entertain the best ideas, the best beliefs, the best thoughts within your mind so that you can consciously manifest the very best at the end of the day always, okay? That's why having a good mental diet is so important. It's because with mental diets, this is just the way that you speak to yourself within your mind, okay? Let's say, for example, that you are manifesting an SP, but let's say that you don't have the best mental diet regarding that SP okay so every single time that you think about your SP which is a specific person you start saying to yourself that this person could never love you this person is too out of reach you can never have someone like that because they're just too high for you they're too this they're too that and you're so this and that all right you're talking and perceiving yourself in a way that is absolutely despicable okay despicable you for real because you're hurting yourself all right you're being self-deprecating toward yourself but to you you perceive 
perceive that to be the normal way of thinking, okay? Your mental diet is kind of trash. So you just assume that what you're thinking is the truth. Oh yeah, it's totally normal that I think that this person is the most high and I'm not. It's not normal, babe. Like it is absolutely not freaking normal. I don't care what you thought growing up, what you've heard your ex best friends say. I don't care what you watch on TV where they always shit on themselves and make jokes about themselves. Get over it, get out and move on for real. Because that kind of mentality is not gonna help you out here. And that is not what having a good mental diet is at all. And I really say this in this way because that is how simple it is to have a shitty mental diet. Whereas where you have a strong mental diet, you know that you're that bitch, you know? Like you know it, you're perceiving yourself that way. You see how this plays into having a good self-concept? That is what helps you get a good self-concept. So instead of you crapping on yourself and talking about how Richard could never like someone like you, you start talking about how, um, <laughs> okay, I am that bitch. So of course Richard is obsessed with me. He needs me, he wants me. I am the one for him because look at me. I mean, come on, I am the most high. I am the one. I am everything, all of that and a bag of chips. You see how your mental diet is thriving in this sense? This is a totally different high, you get me? Chef's kiss for real because damn, pot tasting good because you're cooking good, bitch. That mental diet on 110 and that is exactly what I want for you. And because this helps bring together your self-concept in the very best way possible, there would be absolutely no way for you to fall apart in the sense where, oh, I'm not the one though. I'm not important. I'm not, and yes, you are, babe. You are everything. The money loves you because you know that it does. Your mental diet says money loves me. Money is obsessed with me. Money cannot get enough of me. Money finds me everywhere that I go. That is what your mental diet is regarding money. You're not saying that you're so broke and you're so this and you have no money. Nope, we're not claiming that. I'm not even gonna say it because that is absolutely not you. Okay, same thing with your beauty, all right? You're not gonna sit here and talk about how ugly you are and oh my God, but I'm so this and I'm <laughs> You gotta stop it right now. You gotta start talking about how beautiful you are. No, I am, I'm literally the most beautiful person I've ever seen in my entire life. I know how gorgeous I am. I couldn't look better. I couldn't be better. I am the one, oh baby, all that. And again, a bag of chips because you know it and you perceive that. Your mental diet is quite literally reflecting that. You are choosing that for yourself so of course everything in your reality reflects the fact that your mental diet is on 110 percent and just like i stated before this definitely can be a work in progress for some people which i do entirely understand because again i was one of those people some people don't truly feel that they can stay on top of their mental diet because maybe you're putting a lot of pressure on yourself maybe you assume that your mental needs to be perfect right now that you need to be on your shit right now that you need to know that you got everything that you want right now and of course i mean it's always celebrated and encouraged that you do perceive it that way but it is also entirely understandable if you do not immediately see it that way for yourself especially for someone like me who when I was working on my mental diet you know I had to work on that you know I was perceiving the best case scenario and I was still perceiving that I was gonna get it and that I did already have it but I also knew that for someone like me who had a lot of insecurities and who felt like a total prisoner to my reality and to my thoughts I had to let myself get there so I did let and help myself get there and the way that I did that for myself was every single time that I would think of maybe let's say I wanted to manifest something and immediately my thoughts would go to garbage okay no 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 not gonna happen this that limited uh, okay instead of letting myself sit there and sink within that energy because I was so comfortable there and so used to perceiving my life that way and being so sad and mentally distraught in that form what I chose to do instead in that moment was I decided to work with myself so instead of me consciously or unconsciously agreeing with the shitty mental diet of no, 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 I worked with myself by maybe slowly claiming to myself, no girl, you got this, don't do it to yourself, be good to yourself. Of course you have that. Of course that thing wants you. You deserve good things, girl. Come on, stand up, stand up. You know, I had to really hype myself up. I had to give myself a totally different energy than the energy that I was used to, which inevitably did actually help my mental diet out a lot. Because upon and within me correcting myself in this way, my thoughts were no longer totally pertaining the fact that I can't, I won't, and it's over. But it was positively flipped around in the way where I was actually giving myself some grace. And I was recognizing that grace. And even if I wanted to disagree with that for a while, which is something that I did, I didn't agree with my mental diet for quite some time because I thought it was too unrealistic still. You know, I knew that I deserved it and I knew that it was actually very realistic. I was just one of those self party poopers who, oh, it could happen to them, but not to me. 
but I knew it could. I was just afraid of being happy. But it still did very much help for me to correct myself in that way because again, it started slowly moving up in my highest favor. So let's say for example, I was manifesting something like having good grades, okay? Maybe I never had good grades before, but this time I wanna have good grades. And yet my mental diet was really shitty regarding having good grades. Oh, I never have good grades. I always fail everything, whatever. Me talking to myself and correcting my mental diet in such a helpful and comfortable way for myself is what actually helped me pick it up mentally speaking so that I no longer perceived myself to be a loser in school but somebody who was very successful at school. My thoughts went from I can't do this to maybe I can do this to I'm doing it to I can do this and I'm doing it and that's it, okay? Y'all can see the energy flip here for real because that is exactly how it is when it comes to correcting your mental diet. And again, as you all can see, this is an extremely important thing to do and an extremely important thing to have down pat within your mind where you understand exactly what you're telling yourself is exactly what you're going to get it's what's going to affect your self-esteem your reality your perception of life of everything but you are doing it to and for yourself and if you really do want to be happy within your reality and you do want to manifest all that you want I highly recommend that you choose to stay on top of your mental diet in all of the best ways that you possibly can because you are 110% worthy of having a reality in which you perceive yourself to be the very best for real. Your mental diet deserves to be the most high. You deserve to have that feeling in your heart where you know that you're that bitch, that you can manifest all that you want, that this world is yours, and that absolutely no one and nothing can get in your way because your mental diet is simply that strong. And as you continue to work on your mental diet in this way, your self-concept, my love, it is already done but damn you're going to see for real because the real reason that I am here is because my thoughts are not pertaining any kind of limitations but only limitless things because I know that I deserve that all the way through and if I know that I deserve that all the way through that is exactly what I'm going to get which is exactly what I get within my reality but again it's all because I let it happen for myself so I want you all to remember that while you are working on your mental diet do not disregard it please I know that that is a huge thing low-key <laughs> like a lot of people they'll perceive their mental diet to just be shit so I can't work out of it I'm not gonna it's uncomfortable forget it no like that's not how this works especially with the law of assumption you cannot settle for less than best if you know that you could perceive things in a better light within your mind then don't choose to be a victim to your reality because you don't want to work your way out because you're uncomfortable let yourself feel a little uncomfortable for a little bit which the uncomfortable energy here is literally regarding only shitty things so you want to get out of that anyway but let yourself rise up and above everything else so that you can actually genuinely be happy within your reality and so that you can consciously manifest what you want with ease because that's what you deserve that's what we all deserve and but you got to be the person to make that happen no one's going to correct your mental diet for you people can help you they can redirect you they can push you in the right direction but you're the only person who can actually maintain that for yourself which is exactly what I did for myself you know if I took responsibility over my life in that way then there's no reason as to why you can't as well and I am not playing with y'all y'all already know I do not play games when it comes to this it is literally Literally the best or nothing all right we're not settling for less I don't give a fuck what it is I don't care and I don't care if you've had the shittiest mindset since birth fix it change it move it around because you know that you can because if I did it so the hell can y'all all right if I did everything that I'm saying to you that I did there is not a doubt in my soul that every single person on this earth can do the same exact thing for themselves but they got to choose that to be strong enough to do that because we all are strong enough to do that but we got to choose it and that's what makes the change happen for real don't even pursue it to be something where it's gonna take a long time it's gonna take forever it's no it's here and it's done and that's it all right you're already there it is already done and manifested for you your mental diet is at 110 percent because you allowed it to be because you worked on it and because you're maintaining it here and that's why you manifest all that you want as quickly and as easily as you do all right y'all already know this y'all already knew this and of course you absolutely did because why the fuck wouldn't you i mean hello i'm telling you so y'all are gonna listen to me because i said so and that is it don't play games with me all right i know you never would because if you're playing games with me you're playing games with yourself and i know that you love yourself way too damn much for you to be doing that all right all right then damn <laughs> my god i'm out of breath but i just had to go in because i mean it i really mean what i'm saying guys i love you all beyond words my god thank you guys so freaking much for watching my video today as that's basically it yes it is because that mental diet is not anything that we are playing around with
with. No, it is absolutely not because that mental diet is what feeds your reality. You want the most high? You gotta think in favor of the most high. No victimization bullshit here. We're strong ass warriors for a reason, all right? We're too strong for that, for real, all right? Remember that. And also guys, speaking of diet, okay? I'm really happy to show you guys. Oh my God, my tri treats. Yes, oh my God. You already know I love chocolate and we got chocolate up in here. I'm gonna show you guys exactly what's in here. He's speaking of mental diet, of course. But what tri treats is, is basically treats that that you receive from different countries. It's like a package that you can receive for any random country. It gives you the treats from that specific country. So I think of course that's very cool. And yeah, I know I love chocolate. I love food. I love all that good stuff. So let's see what the tea is because damn, the tea is boiling in the very best way possible, of course. Okay, the country that we got here is Serbia. It says Serbia and Croatia. All right, shit, this is beautiful. Look at that. Oh, can you see it? Yes, that's so pretty. Damn, I wanna be here right now. Head us. All right, all right. <laughs> Manifesting that we are here because we are here. That's it. No more less than literally heaven and paradise. This is where your mental diet should be because it is here and that's it. All right, though, y'all. Look at what I got here. I got Darina Kex. Shit, chocolate looking real good. Y'all already know, of course, I'm going to pick the chocolate from the box. <laughs> But okay, let's see how it tastes like because I'm very curious. I mean, anything that is chocolate, honestly, as long as it's not dark chocolate to me, I'm gonna eat it. But even then with dark chocolate, I'm not even too picky because I feel like if it has a certain kind of filling, like strawberry or something like that, I'm gonna eat it too. I just don't like cocoa kind of dark chocolate. You know, it's like too much for me. But even then, I feel like I can work with everything that is chocolate. That boy nutty, that's what she said. <laughs> okay. All right, let's see how it goes. It says Doreen on all of them, crass, cool. Mmm, bro, it's not even nuts. That's what she said again. It's these little cookies right here. This is basically what it is on the inside. Damn, it tastes so freaking good. Here, I'm gonna give y'all for real because you all deserve it. After having such amazing mental diets, we're all blessed all the way through and I intend nothing but the best for you all for real. And if you guys do wanna get your own Tri Treats box and get some chocolate, oof, man, I want more for real, but I'm not gonna eat in front of y'all right now. I have a discount code for 15% off your first box with Tri Treats called Electrosoul, period without the period, just Electrosoul. And the link to get your own will be down below in the description box if of course you're interested, which I know and manifest that you all are because damn, the treats are always so good, oh my God. If you love food like I do, <laughs> y'all already know what the tea is, of course as always. But all right guys, all right. I will see y'all next Thursday for another video. Thank you guys so much for watching as always. Thank you guys for all of your love. Thank you guys for everything from the inside out. You all mean the world to me and your support goes unfreaking matched, bro. I know I see it a lot, but like I'ma keep on saying it because damn, I always get so pleasantly surprised by all of your kind energies and it's just so overwhelming I just want to wear it on my face Like I just want to wear it and show you guys exactly how it makes me feel for real because it really does mean the world And I just got like goosebumps. Oh, I feel warm and shit. All right, definitely feeling your energy God bless you all forever and freaking always. I love you all so freaking much beyond words. God bless you. God bless you God bless all right angels. Please take care of yourselves. Bye because if that mental diet isn't popping, we don't want it, all right? We want a new diet. We want something that satisfies us, that fulfills us, that fills our needs all the way through. And of course, if you got that mental diet popping, you're not gonna need anything else because you'll know that you are the reason that one, you are manifesting all that you want, but number two, the reason that your life is absolutely perfect in every single way, shape and form, it's because you are allowing it to be that way for someone like you, someone as powerful as yourself. And please guys, do not take this lightly. Having a good mental diet is honestly, I think it's a very strictly needed thing within your reality of course, as it is exactly what fuels your very best case scenario within your reality. You know, you're the reason for the season, okay? You're the reason that you're getting everything that you want, consciously speaking, because your mental diet agrees with you because you're letting it agree with someone as powerful as yourself. And I know that you all want to live your very best lives. I know we're not gonna settle for less. I know that you're not gonna let yourself perceive anything to be less or think in favor of the worst case scenario because that is not anything that you want, all right? If we're thinking in favor of anything, it's going to be the very best and that's final, as always, it absolutely is. So continue working on that mental diet. Remember what I'm saying here and why it's so important. And if you need the advice again, watch this video back because I know what it's like. I know what it's like to have a weak mental diet, a weak self-concept, a weak everything, but bitch, that was in the past. That never happened, all right? I'm the one who's in control here. So if I'm the one who's in control here, I know exactly what I'm talking about. I know my mental diet is popping and so do you because I decided that for you and that's it. 
All right then guys, God bless you all always. Please take care everyone. Please continue affirming, assuming, manifesting the very best for yourself, for your reality, for everything that you got going on, all right? That mental diet is popping and that's it, thriving and that's it, always, all right. God bless you guys. Thank you guys so much again for everything. I love you all more than everything and anything. Keep on doing you and keep on working on that mental diet because it's already worked on and it is perfect and that's that, that's it. All right, my love, God bless you guys, bye.